Hello and welcome to Pop Along RC. Hopefully you've seen the video I put out last week showing you the progress on this painting project. Um, this is the next phase and in today's video I'll be moving on to show you how I paint heated effects on metal. Um, so just to recap then, I started out with this shell that had been painted quite badly, had to sand it back and then I started working with brushes to paint the weathered effect using a number of different browns and oranges to really bring out that rust effect. Some of the techniques that I used um, was dry brushing but there's a lot of layering here with very thin layers of paint so I can build up the colours and the depth and tones. Some of the colours that I was using were actually oil um, washes so I could get into some of the recesses. So today we have got this very plasticky looking interior for the car and you can see at the top there you've got the black uh, roll cage which I sprayed the whole interior silver and now what I'm doing is I'm applying um, these oil washes and what they do is they um, dry so you can see the metal through the colours um, and it's a, just a very slow process this where you have to patiently layer up and layer up and layer up um, allowing the colours to dry in between. The first layer that I put down um, I allow the colours to bleed into one another um, and then once I've done that and it's dried then I'll go in again and I'll add additional layers to soften out any um, really vivid colours. Um, it's about softening those edges and blending in the colours so it runs smooth. The colours that I've used is a blue to start um, into a red which creates a nice purple colour and then once that's dry I use a yellow into the red to make an orange. As you can see here we've got that heated metal effect. Um, I've overdone it slightly um, to create a little bit more colour than I normally would but that is because this roll cage is actually going to be inside the car and therefore it's going to not be seen as clearly um, and having it inside the car I just wanted to exaggerate those colours a little bit more. 